It wasn't long ago that Clay Cross was one of the biggest names in Christian music. Ten number one hits, three Dove Awards, and a Grammy. But even while singing in churches and sharing Jesus with young people around the country, and even with a beautiful and loving wife at home, Clay Cross had a dark secret. I was battling with lust, and that certainly it was being fueled by me justifying seeing pornography. Before you react with shock that a Christian man would look at something like that, take a look at what's happening with this problem among men in church. According to a recent survey by Promise Keepers, 50% of the men attending one of their events had looked at pornography just a week earlier. And Rick Warren surveyed pastors and found more than half had looked at porn in the previous year, while 30% admitted to looking at it in just the past 30 days. Clay isn't surprised. It just grows, your desire for it. And it truly is poison coming into your life. Um, so it may seem like a little bit at first, I'm just looking at this on the side, and of course I would never actually cheat on my wife, but it grows to where you begin to think about that. While Clay says he never cheated physically on his wife Renee, it did affect their relationship. It affected his relationship with Christ even more. So now, as humbling as it is, he is talking publicly about the addiction and how he broke free. He and Renee have even written a book about his experience and her forgiveness. But I really believe God wants me to share this story. I, I know he does. And because there are so many people out there struggling with the same thing, he wants someone to step up and say, hey, I struggled with it and God has forgiven me.